Hi everyone, welcome to Aria the Rescue Dogs channel. I'm Karen and Aria is here. Oh, you can probably see her tail wagon. Oh. <laughs> there she is. There you are, buddy. How are you? Good girl. So yes, I'm Karen, Aria's mum, and we're coming to you live from New Zealand. Hope you're all well. Before we get started, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We really, really appreciate all your support. Now, let's see if we have anybody here with us today. Oh, <laughs> oh we have White Snake in the house. That's Steve, my husband. Hi, Steve. Hello. <laughs> we have someone else in the house watching. What are you doing to my book? <laughs> Hi, Tiffany. How are you? Nice to see you. Thank you so much for coming. And we know that you're really busy at the moment. Here's our little girl. Are you reading the comments, love? Tiffany says hi. Yeah. Right. Funny. Cool. How's everything going, Tiffany? Hope you're not um, too stressed out with all that's going on with you at the moment. <laughs> Still packing. <laughs> Look at you being a good girl today. Girl. Can you hear me all right, love? Oh, okay. Good girl, Aria. Great, thank you. Oh, that's good that you're not too stressed, Tiffany. We missed you last week. We had a few people join us for the chat, but we we sort of figured that you were busy with all you had going on. But you were missed. We missed you. Good girl, Aria. We're all good. We haven't been up to much, really, have we? Have we, Aria? But um, Steve's brother's coming over from Australia on Wednesday. His brother and, and I was going to say his wife. That sounds like that's Steve's wife. <laughs> His brother and his brother's wife are coming to stay with us for a week from Australia. So that'll be really great. She is looking good, isn't she? She actually needs to, well, I think she's put on a little bit of weight again, but she's looking pretty good, aren't you, sweetheart? Apart from the camera in your face. Yeah, we're really looking forward to seeing them, Tiffany. Good girl, Aria. She doesn't seem to mind the camera today. Perhaps she's getting used to it. We've been doing a few um, little videos as well this week, haven't we, Aria? I'm doing a um, putting together a day in the life of Aria the rescue dog. So I've been doing some little sort of videos of each part of the day and then I'm going to put them all together as one video, which will be really cute, eh, Aria? Tiffany says, will we be traveling through your country with them? No, um, what they usually do is they come here and we're sort of their base. So They've actually got a couple of things planned for on the weekend and then the rest of the time we'll be spending together, which is really nice. Going outside today, Bubba. Yeah, you missed a trip around the garden last time, Tiffany. The trip around the garden. <laughs> I mean in the video. <laughs> Oh. 
Do you go for a walk around the garden since it's not raining? It's been raining for days and days. So it's pretty cold, but just get my shoes on. It's pretty cold, but um, at least it's not raining today. Come on, let's go for a little wander around the garden, shall we? Come on. Oh, the sun's come out. Hey, we missed it last week. This is our little garden. It's our compost bin. Cool. Yeah, I can see the comments, love, at the moment. Steve's helping me because last time I couldn't see um, the comments because it was too sunny. And there's our, over there, that grass area you can see, that's the um, golf club, golf course. Probably can't see it, it's probably a bit far away. And it looks like, the sky looks like it's going to rain again. I've got a few weeds coming, but story of the life when you've got a garden. That's our silver beet that we planted. This is our veg, one of our veggie boxes. It's our silver beet. Some rosemary over there. And in the corner, that's a New Zealand fern. When we first came, all this area here had a huge ivy plant and... Um, Punga trees, which are a New Zealand tree, but we had to take them all down because one of the trees fell over. So we're getting there. It's a big garden. And that's our lemon tree. What are you doing, Aria? There she is. That's right, that's Aria's pigs there burying place. <laughs> I hope I'm not going too fast. I have to remember to slow down when I'm going around the garden. There she is. Good girl. So how long have you got till you move, Tiffany? If you don't mind me asking. You tend for, to forget that you're on the internet and that everybody's listening. Well, all two of us. Oh, we're going in the bushes. This is what we always say. This is where we buried the dead body. Because <laughs> there was a big hole in the garden. So our neighbours kindly had some dirt. And we've Steve's filled in the hole. But we're just waiting for it to flatten down. But it looks like it's a flipping burial plot. Okay. I have to watch where I'm going around here so I don't fall over. Oh, well, that's good news that you can get it done in a few months, Tiffany. What are you doing in there, Bubby? Hang on. We really appreciate you showing up because I know you're really busy. It's nice to catch up. What are you doing in there, Aria? This is where um, at night I see the hedgehog. So I think she's having a little sniff around where the hedgehog goes. What are you doing in there? She's eating the grass, maybe. Yep, she's eating the grass. And I'm trying to not get poked in the eye by the lemon bush. Lemon tree. And how are you and how's, how's mum, Tiffany? The hydrangeas that need really trimming. My sister-in-law, Kirsten, when she comes over, she very kindly trims back the hydrangeas for me. I don't know if she enjoys it, but she... She, did, she does it when she comes, so I'm happy. I hope she enjoys doing it. I think she enjoys helping out, you know. There she is. I know, hedgehogs are cute, aren't they, Tiffany? They're horrible. They have a lot of diseases, apparently, but I, when I see them, I think, oh, they're so cute. Good girl, Aria. You thought I was talking about you then. 
I love it how you're kindly going around the garden for me, Aria. Oh, Aria's showing us this is our other veggie box, which is empty at the moment. Isn't it? Oh, I'm glad Mum's okay. What are you sniffing about there, Aria? Looks like it's just us today. Because there's two people in there, so that's you and Steve. Well, that's good. We can have a little catch-up. As usual, when I come on the camera, oh, there's a, just a little dog butt on the grave. And there's me saying on, on live on the internet that there's a dead body buried in there. Probably perhaps, much, perhaps I shouldn't say that. <laughs> I tell you, it's just dirt, really. Good girl, Aria. That's where the hedgehog goes, doesn't it? <laughs> Always get a lot of dog, dog butt when we're videoing, don't we? <laughs> At least you've got a cute butt. Good girl, Aria. It's nice that we can come in the garden. What else? It's, this is usually where we have our tomato plants. And here we've got the spring onions just finishing off. And chilies, some beautiful chilies this year. Oh, can you see? Let's see if I can get some. There we go. But obviously they like the hot weather, so they'll be finished now. <laughs> You're laughing your ass off at the dead body. <laughs> oh, Aria's had enough now, so I think we're going inside. There you are. So you missed the tour last week. That's the back, anyway. Well, you can't really see much out of the front. I'll show you a bit of the view out the back, I think. If I can, I don't want to get the neighbours in, obviously. For their privacy to show you it's the mountains at the back oh got a bit wobbly then yeah so now you've had your own personal tour oh you're back out here good girl you like it in the garden, don't you? Oh, I can hear little doggies. What time is it over there, um, Tiffany? Because we've changed our clocks last week. Actually, I better move closer to the house. I'm not sure how far my internet will go. Come on, Aria. Come on, Bubba. Come on. Let's go back. Ooh, that looks quite nice. Oh, you probably can't see. That's the trees on the golf course. Sunday afternoon, 3.15. So we're 10 o'clock, 10.15 now, I guess. Um, Monday morning. There she is. Oh, the washing's out. Should we go back inside, Aria? Oh, dog butt again. <laughs> Says that's what happens, Mum, when you follow me around. Should we go inside? Oh, the sun's coming out. The sun's coming out, Bobby. Oh, look at the little tail. With a little tail. I saw you got a shout out from um, Louie as well. That was nice, wasn't it? That we got a shout out for our channels. I think I'll do that myself. Oh, you took Joy for a hike up the hill. 
How's little Joy? Come on, Bobby, let's go inside. Oops, sorry. Here you are. Come inside, Aria. Come on, Bobby. Oh, I see we say have oh we did have another visitor, but they've left us. <laughs> Must have been the butt shot, Aria. <laughs> Good girl. You're getting used to mummy following you around now, huh? Oh, I'm glad Joy's good. She's such a cute little dog. I love her little face. Good girl, Aria. Good girl. You've been a good girl. Good girl. Mummy's going to have a sit down for a minute and a drink of water. Makes you thirsty talking. Look at that tail. Look at that beautiful tail. Oh, hi, Dad. <laughs> so cute. So cute. <laughs> say hi, Steve. Hi, Steve. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> oh, thanks, Tiffany. She is a lovely girl. She's a lovely dog. She loves her dad, don't you? She loves her dad. <laughs> Good girl. I've got jobs. Oh, dad's got jobs to do, so he can't entertain us anymore. Come on, Aria. Mummy needs a drink of water. Good girl. She's really good on camera today. Last week she kept wanting to go away, didn't she, and go to sleep? Yeah. Probably that walk I took her on this morning. Probably that long walk she had this morning. Hello, puppy. Hello, beautiful girl. I was thinking of giving her her pig's ear, Tiffany. What do you reckon? That'd be funny. Right, I'm just going to put this camera down for a minute. Yeah, yeah. I need a pink there. Thinking of it. Hang right. on, I'm just going to leave you there with Aria for a minute, Tiffany, because I just need a drink of water. Oh, good girl. Look at her. She's staying right there. What happened? Yeah, it could do. So, yeah, that'd be fun, though. When you're ready to do it, let me know and I'll... Yeah. Thing is, with looking down all the time, it makes me because of my glasses, it makes me go like, whoa. <laughs> so I just need a little break. Yeah. And she's still there on the camera. Yeah. Good yeah, girl, so. Aria. Getting used to it now. Used to having your close up. You ready for your makeup? We'll give you some makeup, put some lipstick on you. Maybe a bit of eyeshadow. <laughs> Good girl, Aria. Should we get you a pig's ear? I'll do it. Just take this one. Maybe. I'll just leave it there for a minute since she's good. Oh, she's gone. Daddy's going to get you a little treat in a minute. <clears throat> That's funny, Tiffany. You're ready for my close-up. <laughs> Steve's just going to get the pig's ear in a minute, so I better get my shoes on. Good girl, Aria. Yeah, I get the humour. <laughs> I totally get it. Okay, I'm just going to get my shoes on. 
Just let me get my shoes on, babe. Yeah. <clears throat> So Tiffany, you are going to get the live pig's ear experience. That's, of course, if I can keep up with her. I'll try my best. I'll try my best. Are we ready? It's on the bench, love. It's on the bench. I put it up there already. I'll see if I can keep up with her. Oh, here she goes. Here she goes. Mummy's got her shoes on. And it's dog butt. Oh, so we can see what we're giving her. Yeah. That's a good idea. Wait for it. Uh oh, here she comes. Oh, mum's walking into the bookshelf. <laughs> Right, put it on the table so babe so we can see show them what it is. Here we go. This is what she's getting. So it is an actual pig's ear. I think it's roasted or something, isn't it? Yes. Okay. And she's off. I'll see if I can keep up. And watch the steps first. Oh no. We should have put my running shoes on. Here we go. Good girl. Have you got your pigs here? <gasps> Where are you going to take it? Oh, 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 oh. Mum's going to get dizzy. Good girl. I'll try not to get too close. <laughs> Good girl. What are you doing with your pigs here? <gasps> Where are you going to put it? You're going to put it with the dead body? Good girl. Oh, she's off again. <laughs> it always makes me laugh when she does it. Where are you going to put it? Good girl. What a good girl you are. She doesn't get these very often. But I always do a video when she has one because it's just so funny. Yeah, she, kept, she just gets these as a special treat because, as you know, she's on a diet. <laughs> Oh, here we go. It's digging a hole. This will be the first hole of many. It's not the right place, is it? That's right, Tiffany. She's got a big decision to make. Oh, second hole. That's a big hole. I hope you know, Aria, that the whole world is watching you dig this hole. Good girl. That's a big hole. It's a big hole. It's a big hole. Good girl. Nobody will find it in there. Miley won't find it in there, will she? She usually runs around with it more than that, but it might be because I'm here close by. Good girl. Just Aria digging a hole with her nose. So that'll probably stay in there for maybe 10 minutes and then she'll dig it up again. <laughs> Good girl. Is that your special treat? Be careful of that stick in your eye. Nobody will find it in there, will they? I know, Tiffany, it's so cute how she does it with her little nose, isn't it? And now her nose will be all brown and then she'll just look around as though I haven't done anything. I haven't buried anything. Good girl. <laughs> what a good job. You did a good job. Miley won't find it in there, will she? She won't find it in there. Tiffany, you know who I'm talking about when I say Miley. Um, 
Miley's parents have actually moved, so we probably won't be seeing my. Oh, look at her nose! <laughs> we probably won't be seeing Miley much anymore. Not, well, we will be seeing her, but not as much as we used to. So that's a bit sad. Because we loved our Miley. Now, why has she gone in there? I think she thinks Steve's making treats or something. Good girl, Aria. She usually takes a lot longer to um, do that. No, she's buried it right here. In a huge hole. I think because I'm so close to her with the camera, um, she decided to dig it, put it right in there. So that was it. <laughs> Shortest pig's ear trip ever. Are we looking at what you buried? What a good girl. Oh, you're a good girl. I know, Tiffany, it's sad about Miley. But the good thing is that she's moved out to the country, so... She's getting a lot more exercise. So she'll love it there. And hopefully um, she'll come back for short visits. Not like she used to, but we miss her already. Yeah, Aria will miss her very much. Oh, Steve's doing the weeding. Excellent. Good girl, Aria. Well, that was the shortest pig's ear video ever. I'll see if I can get close to her nose. Look. What have you been doing? We can see what you've been doing. Yes, we can. <laughs> Good girl, Aria. <laughs> I've seen her nose. <laughs> I might see if I can sit down here if it's not too wet. Oh yeah, it's not too wet. There we go. Have a sit down. Mummy, have a sit down. Hey, little bubby. Oh, a bit close. He's a little waggly tail. Waggly, waggly tail. Exactly, Tiffany. You can't hide the the um the brown nose. Good girl. Oh, it's actually quite nice out here. Not too hot. Good girl. Oh, thank you, Tiffany. I think you've got a lovely voice too. It's nice to listen to you talking to Joy. Oh, she's off. Just when I sat down. Hang on. Now she knows what it's like to be a Kardashian. Hey Aria. Paparazzi's always following you around. What you doing? Seem a bit more active today than usual. Don't you? I think we need a bit of light on the subject. Dark in here. Hang on. Let's see, it doesn't really make much difference. I can't believe you didn't eat your pig's ear. <laughs> I love that. Tiffany said, let's put it together and make an 80s girl band. <laughs> We're talking about our voices. I've heard you sing, girl. You've got a lovely voice. What would we call our band? I'm sure Steve will think of something. Are you tired, puppy? What should we call our band? Um, An 80s pop band. Two old dogs. Two old dogs? <laughs> no. It's, well, I suppose it's better than two old bitches. <laughs> two old dogs. That sounds like a boy band to me. <laughs> oh, you've been very good today, aren't you? So I'll give you a treat for being a good girl. Daddy, could you pass the treats? Yeah. Or just give her a chocolate treat for being a good girl, since she didn't actually eat her pig's ear. Oh, we could, we could do the seat, couldn't we? Whoop. 
Try and get the light. I think it's better this way. That way. That's better. Oh. Oh. Oh, I should have been in front. Why don't you do it with some biscuits in her bed? Yeah, okay. Then she's not having too much, um, too many treats. Just do it with a, a lot of, a uh, handful of biscuits, love. Yeah. And do a seek. Come on, seek, seek. And I'll right. stand over here. Seek. Excuse us, Tiffany, we're just setting up a little. Oh, dog butt. You can look at Ari's butt. Seems to be. Seems to be the end thing. Yeah, seems to be the theme of the day. Oh, he's just dropping some little dog biscuits so because we don't want to have too more, many treats. Good girl. You don't seem to be able to tell the difference, to be honest, do you? Oh, look. She does look happy, doesn't she? You've got treats in her bed. Seek, seek. I can see there's still some in there. Seek, Aria. Seek. Probably doesn't help you got all your toys in there. Good girl. She's still got more in there. <laughs> Come around this sort of water. Good girl. Oh, you like those tree? Oh, mummy can sit down again. Good girl. I can still see more. Seek, seek. Good girl. So as, I, as soon as I turn around the other way, love, she's looking the no. other way. Oh, she is very bright. Yes, Tiffany. She's a clever girl. She picks up things very quickly. Our other dog was a Cocker Spaniel, as you know, Coco. And she... <laughs> she I don't think the, that it wasn't that she was very bright. I think she was just very stubborn. And <laughs> she liked to do what she wanted, not what we wanted her to do. Whereas Ari is very obliging. She um, She's very clever. And she loves to please us. Don't you, Aria? Oh, just that's right. See if there are any more in your in your covers. Yeah, there is one in there. Is there still one in there? Yeah. So yeah, we're just giving her little dog biscuits, not treats, because she needs to lose some weight still. Where are you getting there, aren't you, Bubby? Oh, oh, did you get it? Hey, I can hear her crunching. She got it. Got it. Good girl. Gosh, you'll need a rest after all this. Pig's ears will go. Oh, dog butt. Oh. <laughs> That's her favorite blankie. Oh, you had a cocker as well. They are stubborn, aren't they? Lovely dogs, though. But yeah, she had them. You could tell, like, if you let her off leash. She would run around and then if you called her, she would look at you and you could see it going through her mind like, shall I go or shall I not? And she'd just run off. <laughs> Whereas Aria, in most cases, she'll come back straight away. She was a lovely dog, though. But, yeah, very, um, had a mind of her own, that one. Good girl. I think you got them all now. She got them all, love? Yeah, pretty much. Good girl, Aria. Imagine having treats in your bed. Good girl. What a clever girl. <laughs> Good girl. She might need a she might want to play after all that treat. Oh no, she might want to go to sleep. Oh, so I was going to say, um, I might not have too many videos up next week, but I'll see how I go because obviously we'll have company. 
but um, we'll just see how we go. We just sort of go along with what they want to do. So if we're spending a lot of time at home, I'll still do some videos, but otherwise we might be out and about. There she is. Good girl. I bet she's thinking of pick, digging up that pig's ear again. She probably doesn't want it to do it in front of all the internet. I love yeah. her worldwide audience of six people. That's right, Tiffany. Videos can wait. Good girl. You're thinking of going digging it up, aren't you? I'm just going to go and sit down on the step. I was going to tell you, Tiffany, that we're hoping to go to um, a beautiful forest when it's not too hot. So the weather's quite good now. And I think you'll really love that. It's called the Redwood Forest. And you can take the dog there. And there's certain plates we can let her off leash. So I'm really looking forward to going there. But it'll probably be after the um, relatives is gone because they're just coming here for a rest really so we don't really do do much walking oh there she goes look it's just checking it's still there Are you pigs are still there good girl have you forgotten where you put it already no you didn't put it back there I can't follow her too far that way because we did that last week and the internet dropped off. Oh, Tiffany, the forest is beautiful. And because it's a tourist attraction, um, it's really well maintained and looked after. Like you can go actually go up in the trees and there's a tree walk up there. You can't take the dog up there, obviously. But we haven't done that one yet. We're going to do that without Aria at some stage. And you can go out there at night and it's all lit up. So it's beautiful. So we're looking forward to seeing that, doing that one. And Ari has been there before, but she hasn't been there for a long time. So we're hoping to sort of make a, a morning of it. Oh, here we go. Look, she's digging it up again. I knew it wouldn't take long. We've had quite a few visitors today, but it's like a, a Tiffany and Karen show today. But people keep popping in, so that's nice. I've noticed the more I do these, the more people we have visit, which is always lovely. Because I like to get to know who's watching the videos. It makes it a bit more personal. Oh, here she goes. I don't want to get too close because it might put her off. But she's digging up the pig's ear. <laughs> I told you it wouldn't take long. How long has it been in there? Ten minutes? She's going to dig it up and put it somewhere else now. Obviously this place isn't good enough of a hiding place. Yes, we can have the Tiffany. We can have the Karen and Tiffany show. <laughs> and we can sing as well. We can have dogs and singing. Good girl, Aria. Have you got your pig's ear in there? Wow, you buried it deep, didn't you? Where is it? Did you bury it deep? It's still in there. I'll leave you to it. So I don't want you to get worried that I'm going to steal it from you. Oh, turn your back on me. Dog butt time. What a good girl. Got your pig's ear in there. Did you put a link to the forest, love? Yeah. Oh, cool. Thank you. Good girl. I'll just stay out here. Not too close, eh? Got your pig's ear in there. Thanks, Steve. 
Oh, look, she's got it. She's got it back. Good girl. I knew it wouldn't take long. <laughs> it's not going inside. <laughs> she's going to put it in her dog bed, isn't she? It's a dirty, horrible thing that's just been in the garden. Is it in her dog bed? No. Where is she? No. <laughs> Are you gonna... Oh, that's lovely. All the dirt on the carpet. Yeah, I think you should take it outside. Mummy won't get too close. Good girl. Mum might eat it. Yum, yum, yum. I want to eat that. <laughs> Tiffany says yum, dirt gravy. <laughs> Go on, put it back in the garden, I think. Hey, going to put it back in the garden. Good girl. Where are you going to put it? Where are you going to put it? What is that you've got there? Oh, got your pig's ear. Good girl. She, I can't follow her too far up there, so she's a clever girl. Good girl. Yeah, you better watch out. Dad might want to eat that. Dad might want to eat that. Dad might want to eat that. Hey. Oh, this is this other place she likes to bury it. You've probably seen on the video, this is the other place. Good girl. Got to find a special place, eh? Hey? Got to find a special place. Oh, okay. Oh, I haven't seen her put it in there before. Oh, in the hide ranges. I think she's trying to get away from me, so I won't go too close. Don't put it there. <laughs> no, no. Here she comes. Look at you with your pig's ear. <laughs> she certainly is keeping me on my toes, isn't she? My workout for the day. Oh, she's gone around the corner. I won't go up there because I can only go a little bit further. It's probably just trying to hide it from me. Oh, she's back. Oh, nearly fell down a hole. Oh, that's your other favorite hole, isn't it? Good girl. Lots of things go in this hole. Special. That's a deep hole you've got there, Aria. Oh, yes. I know, she's so funny, isn't she, Tiffany? I mean, who wants to eat that dirty thing? Obviously, it's very precious to you, isn't it, Aria? Very precious. <laughs> oh, gosh. Good girl. Babe, am I still on the internet okay? Right, that's all buried for another 10 minutes. Tiffany, maybe there's minerals in the dirt. Oh, definitely. We definitely have minerals around here. Like you guys, where you are. All that sulfur and sulfur. The veggies grow, grow well. Good girl. What a clever girl. What a clever girl. What 
a clever girl. Miley definitely won't find it in there, will she? And it's not really that further away from the last hole that she dug, is it? <laughs> oh, you're so cute, Aria. <laughs> You're so cute. All right. Oh, let's check it. Oh, this. What have you done? This. Sorry. What's that? Okay, I'm coming back. Yeah, we're the same, Tiffany. Oh, it's a little doggy barking. Better. What a good girl. What a good girl you are. No one will find it there, Aria. I can see by, look at your little nose from all that digging. Good girl. <laughs> what a good girl. Oh, dog butt time. Hello, my friend. Say hello, Stephen. Hi. Oh, no. Right, I'm going to think it's time for us to love and leave you. Where's the sun? Should go around the other way, shouldn't I? Oh, now the sun's coming out. Thank you so much for joining us today. It's been really nice to see you. Tiffany says hello again. Oh, the sun's coming out now. Hope you have a lovely week. And, yeah, I will check in when I can. And, uh, yeah, they're coming on Wednesday and they're leaving the following Wednesday, I think. But there's lots of videos for you to watch anyway. In the meantime, if you miss us, have a lovely day and try not to get too stressed out from the packing. And we'll see. And thank you so much for joining us when you're so busy. We really appreciate it. That gives her a stress free. Um, and I hope you enjoyed watching the digging. <laughs> okay. See you next time, my friend. Lots of love. Bye.